Martin, the Hitman Campman versus Carlos, the Natural Born Killer Condit. The fight just ended. All right, let's recap. Round one. Martin Camp Campman comes out immediately, goes for the takedown. He gets it. The majority of the round is him just basically controlling Carlos Condit from getting up. That's the first round. Second round. It was more of a battle between the both of them. There were scrambles here and there. But the third round is key. Damn. They, they went to war. War. Damn war. Carlos Condit was just demolishing Martin Kentman on the feet. And I was like, you know what? That's why Martin wanted no part of his stand-up in the first round. Definitely. His face was a bloody mess. It reminded me of this. But actually... Martin, his face was much worse. And then uh, after the fight was over, he had cuts on the forehead and then on his cheek or like right under his eye. He was messed up. But anyway, then the fourth round, and that's another thing. Did the UFC advertise that this was going to be a five-round fight? They barely advertised that this was going to be a five-round fight. And what made it worse was that the commission... I looked at the commission's roll call sheet for the referees, for which referees was going to ref what fight, and it said three rounds for the main event for every single fight. So they got, their, they got that wrong. The commission got that wrong, and the UFC barely advertising that it was going to be a five-round fight. I'm like, oh, okay, round four, okay. Carlos kind of lived up to his actual nickname, the Natural Born Killer, because he went after Martin and went for the kill and he got it got the kill ref saw enough he was fight back martin fight back herb dean stopped it boom tko win for carlos condit and then after the fight he they asked him of course what well, what's next for you he goes well i want to i want to fight for the title again the winner of gsp or big rig Damn, I cannot wait for that fight. I'm telling everybody. If anybody has a chance to beat GSP, I'm telling everybody it is big rig. There is a big rig coming for GSP. And I also want to talk about this. Uh, uh, the natural born, born killer, Carlos Kinda, has killer instinct that you can't buy. Unlike Rory McDonald and unlike Jake Ellenberger. Those guys do not have killer instinct. When they fought... It was a scaring, a staring contest with jabs. Horrendous. So it's very refreshing to see two welterweights that go to actual war and actually fight. And it's really refreshing to see one, when he sees a, his opponent hurt, go in for the kill. That's what I love about Carlos Condit. But, but except for the Nick Diaz fight where his strategy was to back up and strike... And Nick Diaz is just coming forward. That one was a little bit iffy. But Carlos is back to his killer instinct ways. Thank you for watching.